outside Nigeria to around two thirds of Europe are now under a warning for drought that looks likely to become the worst in 500 years. The latest European drought observatory figures show that 62% of the land in the EU and United Kingdom is now under a drought warning or alert. We have more in this report. This is the Rhine, and it houses fish of different species. As it stands, walking through the river is now possible due to drought, because instead of 2.8 meters, the water level near Mainz is now only 66 centimeters. Normally, the maelstrom is located in the middle of the Rhine. Now, it is accessible on foot from the shore. With the water so low, some finds reappear like these shopping carts. The mighty Rhine is now only a trickle. The situation is similar on the Elbe and the Danube. The water levels are far too low because water is a particularly scarce commodity this summer. Low water in the rivers and high temperatures are a dangerous combination, especially for the animals. And even if there is still some water, it heats up and the oxygen content drops. The result will then be dead fish, with neither cooling nor rain in sight. In an alarming situation, at least 10 tons of dead fish have been pulled out of the river Oda, which flows along part of Poland's border with Germany, as officials warn people not to enter the water due to possible contamination. Low river levels due to the drought in Europe might have aggravated possible contamination. The drought is also taking its toll on Italy's largest lake. The shoreline of Lake Garda has receded by tens of meters in some places. We had the lake once shimmered turquoise blue. Bare rocks now juts out.